I love the PS2, you love the PS2. I'm not paying $400 for this fucking game. <laughs> Now let's start off small, all right? Futurama. You can get it for around 50, 40 bucks, maybe even 25. I mean, that's not that, 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 hey, hey. But if you wanna buy it sealed, how about you go fuck yourself? Give me $394.90. And guess what? The seal is half broken, piece of shit. So here we are playing Futurama on the PS2. Oh my God, it's so beautiful, isn't it? Imagine spending $400 for a sealed copy of this, and this is what you get. Yeah, 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 yeah. Dude, I always had a suspicion, even as a child, that this guy was, like, definitely a cokehead or something. Alright, let's see if this game is really worth it. Let's see what features we got here. Press triangle to interact. Yes! We have working water, working fucking... We have working taps. Look at that, we've even got cold water and hot water. Yeah, yeah. Alright, that's amazing. Alright, what else we got here? Ooh, we can open and close this fucking futuristic barbecue. About this. The server! Now, I'm gonna be honest with you guys real quick. I recorded this whole game, and for some reason, the audio just didn't record. I almost threw my damn computer across the fucking wall. You know how it says game over here? It's a lie, it's just a cutscene. Watch this. Don't tell me it's game over if it's not game over. Game plover? Oh, if you want to look for some tools I actually need, why don't you find the ones missing from my tool rack? Okay, which ones are missing? All of them. No problem, oh. So basically, I got this, this 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 nice little hammer over here, and you see all these empty tool things. Well, we gotta find every single fucking tool. You can look for all the tools, but there's one missing. You. Look at that! Another working sink. Hey, sir, have you seen uh, any tools lying around? So that's what happens when you watch too much TikTok, guys. And I'm pretty sure that's all the tools. There. Now to go look for the rest of the professor's tools. Stupid Fucking one more tool. Hey, I'm busy here. Hello, Benda. Have you seen uh, the final tool? <laughs> He's reading a Femboy magazine. Very nice. Three working taps. This is a world record. If you don't want to buy this game before, you better want to buy it now. A final piece! I mean, at least we got shooting and shit. Riveting gameplay. I love it. Sold! I'm buying the sealed copy right now. This game is worth every penny. Now, the PS2 had a thing for survival horror. They were in a long, committed relationship. This also means a lot of expensive survival horror games. Silent Hill 2 is one of them. The game goes for like 200 bucks. What the fuck? But this is cool one. The cheapest copies I can find is around 200 bucks. But if you want a sealed copy, you're gonna pay at least a thousand bucks. Or 600 fucking pounds, mate. This one's $2,500 because it's in some fucking plastic container. Are you kidding me? It's graded A plus with a 9.4 rare. Do you see it? 9.4. Fuck you. Fun fact, this game was actually made by the same guys that made Dark Souls, Elden Ring, Demon Souls, Sekiro. So you know this one's gonna be a banger. If it doesn't have a roll mechanic, I'm out. So first things first, we have a dead body on the floor. That's that's the, that's the best thing. I, th I want to see this as soon as I jump in the fucking game. And there's some weird creepy dude over there. What are you, what are you doing, man? Are you, you're running away from me. Hey, you. You fucking come back here. <laughs> Where are you going? So a dead body and some really soothing and calming music. I really get what's going on here. I think um, I think this is a happy children's game. Um, someone's getting eaten over there. Hey, what are you doing over there? Stop eating that man! Oh shit! What are you, you skinwalker? How do I? How do I? How do I kill you? Ah! Oh, you're trying to make out with me! Oh, please, not, not here, not like this. <laughs> How do I? Okay, square to stab him in the head. No, please, I don't want to make out I have a boyfriend. Get away from me. All right, let's see if we can kill this fuck. Please! All right, I think we killed him. Um, it, it looks like that dead body that we saw earlier has been dragged halfway into the fucking river. There's something out here, okay? Dragging dead bodies around. Shit. The children! Stop eating him! <laughs> it's not nutritious. <laughs> fucking children, man, always playing with dead bodies and shit. Where'd you go? Alright, now they're singing a little song, okay? Well, well... Hey, you guys, you guys know what you did was fucked up, right? You can't eat they're dead bodies. Dead. They're dead now because you're eating them! When you don't know what to do in a horror game, what do you do? You follow the red blood trail. We have another one of those fuckers. Um, sir, I think I killed one of your friends! Maybe your brother! <laughs> These guys look so weird, eh? Like, ah, please! I, you always want to make out with me. I know I'm hard, but I'm not that hard. On a real note, this game does seem very creepy and eerie. 
I'm walking into walls. Is it worth the money? Maybe. It's a collector's item at this point, okay? Oh my fucking... So I think when you hear heartbeats, that means something is near you. Hey, that dead body's gone again! What the fuck? Who keeps dragging the dead bodies out into the water? Everyone knows that blood is thicker than water. This would be a good place to cleanse oneself. I knew there was a bonfire in this game. Perform the cleansing ritual, yes. I will cleanse my 8 megabyte memory card. Kwon seems like a pretty cool game. I would play it. If you got a spare thousand bucks lying around, hey, buy this game. Yeah. Yeah. Next up, we have a personal favorite game of all time for me. Bully for the PlayStation 2. This is a Rockstar Games game, and it's a game that is like a GDA game, but it's for kids. The normal edition is about 30 bucks, but what if you want to get the Bully Collector's Special Edition? 59999. That seal, oh my god, that thing has been fucking. That thing has been sealed for decades. And you know what? I just wanted an excuse to play this game. Rockstar Game presents the most epic children's tale of all time if you haven't played this game what are you doing go out and play it basically you just get to beat up people uh, you suck. Suck. You're dead. and then you gotta run away from the teachers when they find out you've been beating you all the kids hey what the fuck are you doing graffiti on my school all right this is my end of the school you fucking little shit have it have a dad uh, i'm gonna break your knee i'm gonna break your jaw and this is what happens you know the, the teachers just want to fuck with you but guess what i can beat up the teachers <laughs> Now this is, this is when it gets really fun. I told you i bring you down. Busted. All right, let's try this again, but I mean, let's just not be violent. All right, guys, no, no, I don't, I don't want to fight. Hey, dude, get it. If I don't start the violence, someone else will. You just got kicked in the nuts so hard, dude. Oh my God, I know that shit hurt. Slide. Ah, I just slipped on a fucking banana peel. Yeah, okay. Yeah? You think I'm joking? How's this, bitch? Remember kids, if you ever get him bullied, just, just turn him around and rip their fucking underwear out of their pants. So this is Bullworth Academy. Um, hello sir. Useless sissy. Oh, look, there's a girl. So, um, you're a girl, huh? Uh, wanna talk? <laughs> she just fucking laughed at me. <laughs> That's the worst kind of rejection there ever was. I'm gonna run away now. That girl just straight up ran the fuck away from me. She just sprinted. Is this game worth the $600 price tag? I think yes. I would spend that any day on this game. Yeah. Another survival horror game. The PS2 just made love to this genre. This game is actually super fucking expensive. 440 bucks for a copy from Japan. And that's not even sealed. $1,100 for a sealed version. So this is Rule of Rose. I'm gonna go ahead and load my game because this game was actually kind of boring. So now I'm left to just try and get out the morning, fucking- Jennifer. How do you feel? I- Yes, Let's I feel amazing. Chat, shall we? Jennifer, you know you've been a bad, bad girl. And bad girls need to be punished, don't they? Now this is some kinky shit. I'm into it. Let the games begin, dear Jennifer! <laughs> Yeah, so I played this game a little bit. It is kind of fucking creepy and it looks like they're sending me free. Thank you guys I really appreciate that. So here we are. My name is Jennifer and I am held captive in some fucking mansion in the middle of nowhere There's a big wooden box covered with dirt and grass The sack inside it is covered in animal hair. They killed my fucking dog All right, and little Max little Max is in that fucking sack. He is the animal hair that is covered in the sack. Alright, sometimes in these videos it's not all about nut sacks, it's about sacks covered in animal hair. Lass, please put me back atop my body. Alright, so we're talking to buckets now. As the girl placed the bucket in its proper place, it spoke. I am the bucket knight, keeper of all promises. Yet time can be so cruel. For I have edge and cannot remember the past. Well, thank you, Bucket Man. You've been a great help. I love the save stations in old survival horror games. Resident Evil, you got the fucking typewriter. <laughs> this game, you got Bucket Man. Silent Hill 2, you got the red fucking sack. <laughs> and in Kuan, cool you got a damn bonfire. That's pretty sick. It's like Dark Souls, but horror. If Dark Souls wasn't more horrible. This looks like a very fun place to be. Alone. In the dark as well. I mean, oh my god. Oh, God, this is not looking fun. I wonder where these hallways lead to. I think we're on a fucking boat, actually. What the hell? Where are they taking me? Looking through the window, the unlucky girl saw that she was above the clouds. We're above the clouds? We're in a fucking airship? 
What? Yeah, this game is just eerie as fuck. I mean, it's probably worth the money. It's probably a fantastic game. I just... I, I don't have the mental capacity. I said we do not have the capacity. I said we don't have the capacity. <laughs> to play survival horror games all fucking day. Do you want to turn me insane? I'm sorry, Jennifer, but you, you're going to have to stay in the air shit. See ya. Yeah. yeah! Just in case you didn't like Japanese games, we got more for you. Dot hack. This shit is expensive. 160 sealed copy for like 250 euros. Registration process for the world is finished. Yes, yeah, so this game is about like some fucking MMO in the game called The World. I never even heard of this before I started researching for the video, so yeah, you probably know more than I do. To start the game, select the world from your desktop. Please enjoy the world. You know, just because you said it, I will enjoy the world. The day that he first played the world. Oh, this is so beautiful. Oh my god, it's like Japanese World of Warcraft. What is with Japanese video games just having the best soundtracks of all fucking time? Just listen to this beautiful symphony hacking, of just... Which allows him ah. to gain entrance into... Alright, let's start up the world, baby. Version 3.65. Log in. Now this is kind of trippy if you think about it. It's like it's a game inside of a game and I'm playing it through another game which is emulation. So I mean it's like it's emulated through a game. Which is well here we go. We're in the world. Oh my god. It's a game within a game. So here we are. Uh, we're gonna battle these fuckers. Uh, how do I attack? I don't know how to attack. I don't know. I don't know what the buttons are. What are the controls? Someone please read out the controls for me. Controller. Oh shit. Well, that didn't last very long. So if you think about it, this game is just an MMO, but it's not really an MMO because it's not online. Now I'm sure this game is worth every penny, but to me, it is not. I would never pay this amount of money for a game that I merely do not understand. Yeah. Yeah. If you made it this far, you're of course the sickest of the sickest cunts in existence. I want to thank you for watching. Subscribe if you are new here. How about you go ahead and click here to watch another epic gaming video while I sit here and run around for the next 15 fucking minutes. I'm just, I'm enjoying the ride, man. This is fun. This is really fun. Okay, I'd really just die. Yes. Oh, hello. Oh, you're a big body. What's up? Oh, you have a big bottom.